let's take this interesting problem and uh, you can see that we need to find out the series um, 1 by 1 minus 1 by 4 plus 1 by 7 minus 1 by 10 and this thing continues to infinity now two important aspect we need to see from here is that uh, like uh, in the denominator 1 4 7 10 so basically we are having an AP in the denominator and uh, this type of number comes generally in the denominator for log series so we need to use the log series here and uh, another thing is that you can see that there is a periodicity of 3 so there is a jumping of 3 so we need to use the concept of cube root of unity here along with the log series so um, we should start with uh, the log series that is ln 1 plus x and ln 1 plus x will come out to be x minus x squared by 2 plus x cubed by 3 minus x4 by 4 to infinity and uh, we need to use the concept of cube root of unity so replacing x by omega x it will come out to be omega x minus omega square x squared by 2 plus x cubed by 3 minus omega x4 by 4 you can see that I'm using the higher power symmetry of omega and uh, then one ln 1 plus omega square that will come out to be omega square x minus omega x square by 2 plus x cube by 3 minus omega square x4 by 4 to infinity now you can see that according to the series we need to we need to uh, keep one by one that is one alive so we need to keep these terms alive then we need to keep these terms alive and we need to delete these terms that is uh, this particular terms and this particular terms need to be deleted and these terms has, has to be survived so what we can do here is that uh, to kill this set of terms so what we can do is that uh, for this particular series we can multiply with omega square and for this particular series um, we can multiply with omega because if we multiply with omega square then this is going to be omega cube and this is going to be omega cube that is one similarly this is going to be omega cube and this is going to be omega cube so that will be one so these terms are going to be survived on addition so after this if we add after this if we add the three quantities then you can easily see on adding these three will be clubbed then these three will be clubbed and on addition these three will be cancelled out because 1 plus omega plus omega square is 0 similarly 1 plus omega plus omega square will be 0 so um, you can easily see that if we add the three series and then put x equal to 1 so putting x equal to 1 and then adding we will be getting ln 2 plus omega square ln 1 plus omega plus omega ln 1 plus omega square so this is going to be equal to 3 times 1 minus 1 by 4 plus 1 by 7 that is the required series so 3 times the required series so the required series s can be said to be 1 by 3 into ln 2 plus omega square ln 1 plus omega 1 plus omega is minus omega square and uh, 1 plus omega square is minus omega so now we can take the help of a little bit of complex number to simplify this quantity so it is coming out to be omega square into ln minus omega square uh, is uh, nothing but e to the power i pi by 3 in the Euler form and uh, minus omega is uh, nothing but e to the power minus i pi by 3 so on simplification this will come out to be 1 by 3 log 2 plus i pi by 3 common omega square minus omega and as you know omega square minus omega is nothing but we can substitute the value of omega square and omega omega square is minus half minus i root 3 by 2 
and omega is uh, minus omega is plus half uh, minus i root 3 by 2. So we will be getting a purely real answer. We are getting an answer of this series as 1 by 3 ln 2 plus pi by root 3. Because this iota will be multiplied with this iota to give you minus 1. So this is the final answer.